no extrema fomenia. Today, there are fancy electric sports cars and super fast ones too, like the Rimac Nevera, the Pininfarina Batista, and the Loda Savaia. Now, there's a new one called the Estrema Fomenia from Italy. It's not just good looking, it's really fast. A company called Automobili Estrema in Modena, Italy made this car in 2020. They showed it to the world at Blenheim Palace's Salon Privé. It was a concept car at the time, but it will come out in 2023. What's special is that the Fulminia will be the first car with a super advanced hybrid battery. It uses special batteries and other things to make 2,040 horsepower. That's enough to go from 0 to 200 miles per hour in less than 10 seconds. Pretty exciting, right? The shape of this beast is as wide and raw as its speed. Exterior The Fulminia looks super futuristic, just like you'd expect. It's Italian, so it's all about looking amazing and unique. The designers aimed for four things, making it look sensuous, elegant, pure, and balanced. The front is a bit like a Ferrari 458, and it has long, cool daytime running lights. They used a lot of carbon fiber in the body, and it has wings on the sides to make it seem like it was hit by lightning. At the back, there's a big diffuser, a wing that can move, and really stylish LED taillights. The back lights look like the front ones with two vertical lines. Plus, it has those cool butterfly doors. You can get it in only one color called Azuro Savoia, and it rolls on OZ racing wheels with Pirelli tires. The car is also smart about how it goes fast. It has special air inlets in the front and back to push it down the road, and some big ones on the sides to let out hot air when it breaks. It's got other fancy stuff like a front air intake, something called an S-duct, and a wing that can hide away when it's not needed. The Rear View The car's wheel arches go up a bit, making it look like a teardrop, you know, like a teardrop shape. The back of the car looks really futuristic, like it's from a sci-fi movie showing how we might get around in the future. They thought a lot about how the car should look and how people will like it. The cool thing is that the rear lights are made in Turin, Italy, and they're kind of sunken into the car's back. They use special see-through panels and colorful LED lights to make the back lights look like shiny fiber threads. That's probably the most awesome part of the car. Interior The inside of the Estrema Fulminia is a secret for now, but we think it'll have a sporty cabin with two seats. The dashboard will be simple and it'll have nice materials, comfy racing style seats, automatic climate control, a fancy steering wheel, a digital screen for information, and a touchscreen for stuff like music and connections. For safety, there will be airbags and seat belts with four points to keep passengers safe. And for sure, this extra safety is needed if your car is added with something as powerful as the engine of this car. The engine. This fancy car can go about 520 kilometers on one charge, and its battery isn't very heavy, just 300 kilograms. So, with the battery, the whole car weighs only 1,500 kilograms. The Fulmini is known for being sleek and using really high-tech stuff that car makers usually use. It's made from a special light material and uses cool technology like wind testing to make it super aerodynamic. It even has moving parts on the front and back to help it go faster when needed. Because electric cars are getting really popular, the Fulminia has some of the best tech you can find in the car world right now. The Drivetrain The Fulminia is super powerful with four electric motors, one for each wheel, making a total of 2,040 horses. That's why it can go from 0 to 200 miles per hour really fast in less than 10 seconds. It's one of the quickest hypercars out there. This car looks super cool with a special body made of lightweight carbon fiber. It has a rear wing, a shark fin, and lots of holes to let air in and keep it cool. They thought about how the car should look, taking inspiration from really fast animals like sailfish, peregrine falcons, and cheetahs. The lightning bolt is their logo, and it's a big deal for them. The car's headlights and taillights use clear material that makes them look like they're floating, especially at the back. It matches the lightning theme and looks really cool. A lot's been talked about the battery technology of this beast, and why is that? Battery and range The Estrema hypercar is the very first car in the world to use a special kind of battery. This battery is super high-tech because it combines ultra-capacitors and solid-state lithium-ion batteries, making it more efficient than regular batteries. Even though BMW said solid-state batteries would take a long time, Estrema teamed up with Abbey Group to make this hybrid battery, which can be 50 to 100% better than normal ones. The Fulminia has a 100 kilowatt hour battery that can go 323 miles on one charge. If we do some quick math, that's about 3.23 miles for each kilowatt hour. 
when we compare it to the Lucid Air, which has the best mile range for each kilowatt hour at 4.58, it's a bit less efficient. Also, keep in mind that the Fomenia's range rating is more generous than the Lucid Air's, which follows stricter rules. Still, Estrema did a good job because their 100 kilowatt hour battery is not too heavy, about 660 pounds. Its gigantic size surprisingly hasn't translated into weight. The weight. From what people are saying, the Fulminia is going to be the first Italian hypercar with an electric motor that can make 450 watts of power for every kilogram of its battery. That's something special. Plus, it won't be too heavy for an electric car weighing about 1,500 kilograms. Bottom line, the Estrema Fulminia is an amazing Italian hypercar that's perfect for both the racetrack and regular roads. It's super powerful and handles corners like a breeze. They plan to make 60 of these cars in three years, which means about two cars every month. The 61st car will be owned by Pizzuto himself. They aim to make these cars like precious works of art that will become even more valuable over time. When they start delivering the cars in the second half of 2023, one of these gems will cost around $2.38 million in Europe. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more incoming cars reviews and do let us know your feedback in the comments section.